This is like a dream come true for Isaac. Yeah! Nice push! What the heck? You got it! Yesterday, our day in Paris was very organized. There were tours and schedules and times we had to be different places. Today is open-ended. We just came into Paris to explore. We hope the weather holds up and we're able to play at some playgrounds and walk through some gardens and eat some good food. <laughs> They're having fun chasing the birds. A spot for public chess. So this is just a big public space and there's a bunch of people playing chess on the tables here and so we were able to come up and just start playing with people. This is like a dream come true for Isaac. How many always wanted to be at one of these places? No? Not so much? <laughs> this is so cool, the tables are made for chess. Yep. Good and it was like a, a grown man that like played chess. I had no idea how good it would be. Wait, did he win his other game or did he lose it? He won. He won. Okay, so that that's what I thought. So I was like, oh shoot, he's probably gonna destroy me. And he was beating me at the beginning. So yeah. But I just made some good moves. It's so cool that people just like have like tables out and they can just play each other like. I think chess is one of my favorite ways to socialize, even if it's pretty quiet. Pretty quiet, yeah. <laughs> it's funny when he did that like joking move. I know. I, I, I think he was trying to get away with it because that wasn't very helpful to him. Yeah, you're like, he no. I was like, mm -mm. Your, your king is there. <laughs> There they are. Floor has Greece. All right, we've got Greece and India. Sweet. Bye, bye, You did it. Yeah, put it right there. Nice. Good job, Janae. Floor crashed with Zambia. Yep, they're like stranded, crashed in the middle. They're moving though, kind of. No. It's going towards. Let's go, Janae. It's going. All right. Janae is getting our boat that has the Indian flag on it. Well, now push. Yeah. My boat is stranded. I think your boat's doing just fine. All right. Laura has the grease boat. There we go. Isaac just sent India off. Nice push. That was perfect. This is a fun way to play. When the wind stops blowing, the sailboats just kind of chill out there, but then when the wind picks up, they really take off. Nice sunglasses. Snack time. Sign me up. The kids are having a lot of fun trying to recognize as many countries and flags as they can on the boat. Brazil! Brazil! That one's Brazil. Brazil. You're right. There's France. USA. Look how quickly the weather changed. See the storm? Coming. Do you see the storm coming behind you? What the heck? Like that happens so fast. You get blue skies with palm trees. Scary mansion building with huge storm behind it. We might want to get out of here before the rain starts. That's cool that they have all the different countries' flags on the boat. And then they also have a pirate. They do? Yeah, that black one. Oh, cool. You've been getting so good at this, Laura. Do I get to do it again? Yep. I get to keep going? Yep. Wait, what? I'm going to go again. Nice. Wait, 
job, Laura. Oh, really? Today I tried to throw a little piece of bread to the fish and it came back and whacked me in the face. <laughs> <laughs> The okay. uh, beginning of rain has come. Yes, it has. Right, let's bring up those boats. Our um, boats are still out on the fountain. Dad, look at that. Oh, a bunch of big fish. As the rain is starting, families are scattering. Umbrellas are going up. The jackets are coming on. We maybe should get an umbrella. We should. Should we get an umbrella? Excessive. Yeah. On this direction. So the dark clouds are over us, but it, you can see blue skies coming. That's exciting. So they have these little jousting sticks and they try to catch the key. Janae wants to have a turn jousting too, so we're gonna have to ride again. Yeah. Janae, is it your turn to be on the outside? Yeah. You get to joust? Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Are you gonna get a lot of keys? Yes. You got a jouster. You got it! Yeah! <laughs> you are doing so good. We have the cheering section over here. Yes, good job, Nene. Well, the rain is gone, and the park is here. Yeah. The rain never really came. That was a bit of a false alarm. So we decided since we were right next to the park, we're going to do it now. Because yeah. Because we have learned on this trip that if you say, oh, we'll come back, we'll do that later, it doesn't always work. Rarely. I've heard people say that one of the most important things to do in Paris that many tourists don't do is slow down, relax, and enjoy the area. And I really feel like that's the theme of today. Good job, Janae. <laughs> Whoa. La, 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 la. Trying to get across. <laughs> Got it. Kind of like bocce ball. Yeah. What's it called? Some French name. Well, the girls kept playing and playing and playing at the playground. They just did not tire out. So we just now pulled them away, had everybody go potty, and now we're headed to find some food. Uh, Kevin and I are on the train during rush hour to uh, go to the gluten free bakery. What are you most excited to eat? An eclair, a croissant. All the like things yeah. that are We'll have to see though if we're able to go to the Sorry, I'll look at that. Oh, we made it. We made it up. I want to hear what everybody's craving. What are you craving right now? Gam canoe. Oh, he went German on me. What are you craving? Nutella and crepes. Crepes. That's more likely for me to be able to find. What are you They're craving? Craving. Ice cream. <laughs> you craving crepes. Ice cream. You're craving ice cream? That sounds cold. What are you craving? I am craving dulce de leche crepes. Okay, so I'm it sounds like crepes are on the menu. Hot chocolate. I am and too. I am cold. Oh my gosh, that smells so good. Everything smells so good. Oh my goodness, that says crepes right there. And that has everything we're craving except for dinner. Let's go get some dinner first. Dinner, children. I want that. Oh, that does look good. Oh, everything looks good. Okay, let's go find some real food. This is a charming street. Gluten-free bakery. How is it? I decided to just stop at the first cafe we came to because we're tired and we don't want to walk a lot and this looks amazing. Oh, there really are frog legs. <laughs> so they gave us these very interesting utensils. They said these are for the snails. Um, okay, so Isaac? <laughs> we asked the waiter, like, if the snails were good, and she was like, yes. Yeah, so, I was gonna get them either way. Yeah, yeah. you're excited to try this? So, we got our snails. Are you gonna try one? 
No. No. I think after this, I'll never see a snail the same way again. That's probably true. Are you gonna try one? No. Are you gonna try one? I'm guessing. This is fun just to watch you guys try to figure this out. Isaac's trying to hold the devices and they get the food out. Oh, she's getting it. Oh, she's got it. That's a snail. Can I eat it? Yeah, you can. Oh my gosh, that is so good. I spilled it in my water. <laughs> You have snail water? Wow. It's like you're trying to birth a snail. <laughs> I think that would go a lot better than this. Yeah, perfect. Mm, that's so good. That was very hard. But was it good? Delicious. Here, you want to try one? Sure. Oh, now they're interested. Oh, Elisa's helping them out. Good? It's like pesto. It's like a mushroom kind of. Is it good? He's thinking. It's interesting. Uh oh. It's not that bad. Now you eat another one. Girl. A little bit spicy at the end. And the end doesn't taste that good. What do we think? Mom, your turn. Is it my turn? I was hoping so. I can feed myself. And the well, I actually really like pesto's mushroom and the onion. And the end oh, tastes like seafood. The end tastes like a little bit spicy. It's not bad. Chewy. Definitely, yeah. A little grainy there at the end. Not bad at all. Who comes up with this stuff? Who decides, well, let's eat snails? I was not expecting snails to taste that good. Yeah. Our waitress just told us the story that when she was growing up, when it rained, they lived out in the countryside and she and her grandmother would go out and collect the snails and cook them. So, so delicious. In all the cold, I was craving soup and they have onion soup. At home we call it French onion soup. Oh, it's just, it's just onion soup. <laughs> now here it's just onion soup. Nice. Do you have sell? I, I fell. You so, fell like into and traffic. And I fell into traffic. This is the cutest thing I've ever seen. Whoa. That is a big, big old rat.